How can mobile PCs be more relevant and useful when you're on the go? That's what we asked ourselves when we started imagining the best user experience for people using mobile PCs running Windows Vista. When you take your mobile PC with you, you face challenges that you don't encounter with a desktop computer. For example, how do you enter text while standing up? When Windows XP was released, tablet PCs provided new, natural ways for you to interact with your mobile PC when you're on the move or away from your desk. But it is difficult to use a digital pen to interact with something that was designed for mouse and keyboard input. Pen cursors, panning, pen flicks, and tablet PC input panel are all features in Windows Vista that enhance pen computing. It's sometimes difficult to tell if you tapped hard enough with your digital pen. Pen cursor feedback shows subtle rings that reinforce correct pen behavior so you know whether you tapped, double tapped, used press and hold for right clicking, or pressed the pen button. Scrolling is something you do all the time. Because using a pen to control small scroll bars can be tedious, we implemented panning in Office and in Internet Explorer. Panning is a more direct way of moving the page and feels natural with a pen. We also added some weight and physics to the pages so you can throw them up and down. As you learn to throw pages up and down, you naturally start to perform a flick gesture. Flicks are short, quick strokes that you can perform in the eight major compass directions. For example, flicking up drags the page up. Flicking down drags the page down. The first time you perform a flick, a message appears asking if you want to learn more about flicks. If you tap on the message, a training application opens and teaches you about flicks and gives you an opportunity to practice using them. Flicks are especially useful on a Slate tablet PC, a tablet PC without a built-in keyboard, because keyboard shortcuts for copy, paste, and other common tasks aren't available like they are on a desktop computer or on a convertible tablet PC. The diagonal flicks are editing flicks that can be used to copy, paste, delete, and undo. You can also customize flicks to whatever key command you want. When standing and holding the tablet, the pen is the most convenient method to interact with the PC. To enter text, you can use Input Panel to convert your handwriting into recognized text. Recognition accuracy needs to be high. We used context to increase the accuracy of the handwriting recognizer. For example, when you write in an address bar of a web browser, the text is recognized as a URL. When you write in a text box, the text is recognized as prose. Recognizing handwritten passwords has proven difficult, so an on-screen keyboard appears for password fields in web browsers. This also prevents an onlooker from reading your handwritten password. If you write something that you didn't mean to, you can quickly erase the ink by using the scratch-out gesture. Windows Vista includes several new, more natural scratch-out gestures. To increase handwriting recognition accuracy further, you can train the recognizer about the way you write characters and words by providing handwriting samples in the Handwriting Recognition Personalization tool. You can also greatly improve handwriting recognition for words such as proper nouns, acronyms, and technical terms by adding them to the handwriting dictionary. We also focused on improving the experience for all mobile PCs in two key areas accessing mobility settings, and connecting to an external display, such as an additional monitor or a wall-mounted plasma display in a conference room. On a mobile PC, there are several settings you will likely want to change. In previous versions of Windows, these were scattered throughout Control Panel. To improve discoverability and ease of use, these mobility settings are now grouped together in one place called Windows Mobility Center. You can change display brightness, adjust volume, change power plans, adjust your wireless connectivity, rotate your screen, add an external display, sync your data with other devices, and turn on presentation settings. Hardware manufacturers can also add other settings to Windows Mobility Center. In the past, projecting your display onto another display was a difficult hurdle. Now when you connect an external display to your mobile PC, Windows Vista automatically detects the display applies the video settings that are best suited to it, and then starts to project immediately. You can then choose how you want to project your display, mirrored, extended, or external desktop only. 
and when you disconnect, the original display settings are restored to your mobile PC. The display settings apply automatically the next time you connect that display. To make it possible to move around freely while giving a presentation, we implemented wireless network projection. You don't even have to plug in a monitor cable to project your display. Through network projection, you can give presentations on your mobile PC without being tethered to one location in the room. Together, these features make mobile PCs easier to use when you're away from your desk or on the go.